Hello, I'm Drawing Pin, and welcome back to Project Zomboid, where we are Johnny Adams, a veteran, and we are at Fort Redstone. We cleared most of the fort out, or we cleared a big portion of it out, but there was still hangars down at the airport and stuff to clear out. There is the medical building up this way somewhere that we're going to have to clear out as well. And there is a burnt out, let's get moving while I talk. Uh, there is a burnt out building down here as well. Um, you can see kind of bits of it there. There we go, this whole burnt out building, so I'm not too sure what's there. Um, I think we're going to continue this way. I was going to just spend the epi or, uh, spend the day and just sort of uh, clear up some bodies and stuff off camera because, uh, you know, there's a ton of that and it's just me picking bodies up and piling them up ready to burn them because there is we killed a lot of them. And yeah, there's a huge, huge pile of bodies here. But I think I thought that actually the... Um, the helicopter event is going to happen soon. It might happen today. It might happen tomorrow. So I figured uh, we'll carry on uh, clearing everybody out. We could go in here and have a look, I guess. Hmm. I don't think there's going to be a huge amount of stuff in there. We could go in there and have a look, though. Uh, or I'm kind of more tempted to hop the fence here and just carry on clearing out this part, um, the hangars and stuff. Uh, although I don't think there's going to be too much here. Is that more fuel? We've been in here and cleared out a lot of this. It's not totally clear, but, uh, you know, I think it's... No, it's just uh, it's just kind of fuel storage or something. But, yeah, we could jump over the fence here. And uh, there's, like, the control tower and stuff to go in as well. Uh, there's a ton of stuff to go through. With, uh, we've, I've got to uh, loot this place at some point as well. Uh, there is the... Oh, there's a gate there. I never noticed that. Okay. Oh, there's a storage crate there that's open. That I don't think we've been in yet. Here we go. Some more customers for the shotgun. There we go. We're going to just continue blasting, I think. Um, yeah, I, I'm not too sure where we're going to live. I'd say I kind of tempted to live down here um, in this fort, but I'm not exactly sure where we're going to live. So uh, kind of need to scout out some of the places. I'm thinking near the pe petrol pumps, which are over in that direction. Uh, there were some buildings over there as well. Aviators. Let's just kind of have a look. Yeah, there's like a lot of these... Um, like combat fatigues and a bunch of that stuff, boots and helmets and bags and stuff. Uh, when I collect the bodies up, I'm going to, you know, uh, collect all those up and I'll take the... Again, I, I could probably just take all that stuff. As I move the bodies, I'll just check them, loot them for any good stuff and then, uh, you know, dump them in a pile and, you know, we'll go from there. Uh, let's see what's in here. Cigarettes, well, we might as well take them, I guess. Scrap electronics is good, but I'm not going to bother with that now. Hand sickle. Box of small screws, suppressor oil. Hmm, not sure what that is, but that sounds kind of important. So, or is that just a suppressor with oil in it? I'm not really sure. Wow, that's cigarettes galore, isn't it? And, oh, ton of stuff for uh, burying bodies. I was like, I think I'm just going to pile them up and burn them, to be honest. Um, the It's going to take so long to bury them. I think you could put, like, unless it's changed, you could put, like, five bodies in a, in a grave, and it's just like... It's going to take so long to fill those up that I don't think I'm going to do that. Let's just quickly check the bins. Short crossbow bolt. I'm not really bothered about that, to be honest. Lighter. We've got lighters. I guess we'll take a lighter. Uh, I'm kind of hearing zombies somewhere as well. Uh, more cigarettes. Yeah, I'll say cigarettes, um, you know, I'm not going to grab them all because they're just kind of everywhere for the most part. So, oh, hello. Goodbye. <laughs> uh, oh, how dare you. That's not on. You're not supposed to get up from that, my friend. There we go. There was, uh, yeah, there's the hangar down here. This is where we, we came in that side last time. Yeah, this is working out well. I've got a box of shells on me as well. Uh, I don't think I've filled my water bottle, actually. That is something I should have done. There was a lot of them in this hangar. Oh, wow. This thing's like a sniper rifle. It's ridiculous. It's like, how the hell did I kill that one? And all three. It's just, yeah. Damn. I, I know the shotguns are awesome, but they do make a hell of a racket, which i say, if you're in Rosewood, this is not an ideal thing. I would not recommend it. Damn, we are leveling up so fast. It's crazy. But, you know, we are a veteran, so we do get a bonus on that. But the shotgun really helps with the uh, extra splats as well, extra damage. 
extra splats. Yeah, that's a that's a technical term. Pin. Okay, there's a bunch of them not dead yet. Yeah, I mean this is working out. I'll say the helicopter might happen today, but it might not. Um, that's, I've really I'm gonna have to like oh wow, uh, more cigarettes. I'm gonna have to like um get a truck or something and pile all the bodies onto that maybe. I don't know, there's so many bodies to deal with. I've never dealt with this many before, so... Um, I'm just having a quick look, but I'm not largely looking if they've got, like, a key, which probably outside they generally had a better chance of spawning a key if they were inside a building. But, um, you know, they might have keys. Uh, but probably not. There's, there's stuff that I will take. I'll say I will go through them all and take the... Take all the stuff off them. Uh, take the backpacks. I won't take them all, but I'll take some of the backpacks and stuff. Oh, wow, man, this is... Damn, this is just full of stuff, isn't it? Wow, is this all crates full of stuff? Tomato seeds, that's pretty good, actually. I might take the tomato seeds there. Potato seeds. There we go. Ooh, a hammer. I'm not sure I've got a hammer, actually. Probably passed up a few hammers already, but... I'm not sure I've actually got a hammer. That's going to be handy. Uh, let's check most of these boxes. I think that's lighter and a tent peg. I, you know, I've got lighters, I've got matches. I can't take it all, so uh, plank and nails again. That's going to be really nice. Uh, I think I have to take that. Uh, there's that um, Hummer that we had with the whole paint and paint brushes. Can I actually paint stuff? I'm not sure. That might be a mod that you have to put on. Um, but, uh, yeah, I think these... Oh, do these have... Okay, these have... All right, just paint. Fair enough. Is anything actually good in here? Broom and a fork. I'm going to take all the seeds because we are going to need to put a farm up pretty soon. So, uh, you know, it's going to be something that... I'm just going to kind of quickly just run through this, but I think it's largely planks and stuff, uh, which is, you know, not bad. But, uh, yeah, that's decent. Let's have a quick run. I don't want to spend too long in here. But, uh, yeah, it's like paints and stuff. That's fine. Uh, what was that empty bucket? I'll take I'll take the seeds because they ain't going to weigh much. But I'm kind of weighed down as it is. Right, okay, let's... Anybody in here? Hello? It's like a machine shop or something, maybe? Box of nails again. Torch, nails, bundle of short crossbow bolts. Uh, like long crossbow bolts. Absolutely awesome. I'd love that. Love love a bunch of those. Oh, there's an upstairs to this place. Oh, well, we could live in a hangar. Hmm. I don't know. I will say, we've got to find somewhere to... Oh, duct tape. I mean, that's always a good one, isn't it? There, there's, I would say there's just so much stuff to take. Safety goggles. I mean, that kind of seems like it might be a good idea as well. Box of nails. Um bag of plaster i mean all this stuff is great i mean wow yeah i i i think we're probably going to live here to be honest uh oh tires glue empty gardening spray can bayonet metal working magazine i think i've already got that but i'm going to take that with me yeah it's going to take me it's going to take me a week i think to just uh ooh, fishing tackle it's going to take me like a week just to loot this place i think to be honest there's just so much good loot here it's kind of one-stop shop. You don't really need anything else once you've come here. A tow bar. Ooh. Yeah, that means we can tow vehicles. Well, that would be good. Ooh. I, I bet that's really heavy, isn't it? Um, Yeah, there's so many cigarettes. I got a ton of them. Uh, 20. Yeah, that's too heavy. I'm thinking, can we hook that to the Hummer and then tow another car around? Um, and then, you know, we've got like a trailer. We, there is trailers somewhere as well. I have a mod with trailers, but as yet, I've not actually found any uh, gun cleaning kit. Well, that sounds a good idea. I'm just being very picky with what I'm taking, but, you know, to be honest, all of this is great loot. And, you know, if I don't take something, just, you know, don't yell at me. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to take it. Just there's so much to take. There's no way I'm going to, you know, I'm going to fill up in two minutes flat, two seconds flat, and then that's it, you know. Uh, doesn't seem to be anything else up here. Is this just decorating rubbish? Yeah, okay. Decorations of rubbish. Fair enough. Uh, right. I've had a decent look in there. Let's have a run in the other one. 
I'm assuming it's going to be a similar sort of thing. I need to find a sink, actually. That's something I do need to find. Uh, we killed a lot of stuff in here in the last time. This is the one we came through, so... I wonder if there's anyone still in here. Let's have just a quick search. Oh, wow. Is this ammo lockers and stuff? Oh, my God. <gasps> there's so many boxes of ammo. Oh, my God. A Daewoo? Okay. Just... Damn. Oh, I mean, look at that. Oh, my God. This is the mother load right here. I miss I miss uh, spelt the last episode because damn look at that. Pfft, wow. Yeah, we got ammo for it's like what's about this one? Is this just uh, it's just barrels that I don't think I can lose? Fair enough. Yeah, I oh my god, there's more of them. There's zombies in here though. That's I should kind of no oh. <gasps> medical supplies battery. Yeah. Oh, okay. Not what I expected, but still. Yeah, pretty good. I say I'm just scouting, so I'll take the shotgun shells because I am using the shotgun. So let's take those. Oh my god! <laughs> I don't think I can. I, I mean, to be honest, should we stay at this place? I don't know. Feels too OP to me. Same time though, it's damn awesome, isn't it? I can hear a zombie somewhere. Where are you? I hear you. Where are you? Where are you, zombie? Are you upstairs? I don't know. Where are you? Yeah, where are you? You're in that, you're in that container, I think. You're either out there or you're in that container. Hmm. You might be up here. Okay, right. Oh, this feels stupid. Which is probably why I'm doing it, I guess. <laughs> yeah, there's just... There's like... I don't think you'd ever actually need to leave this place. Once you've cleared it out, there's probably enough supplies to be getting on with and never really leaving. I'm not going to do that because that's just stupid. Uh, you know, I'm going to go and explore the world as well. But I do think we are going to set a base up here. So our base of operations, and then we'll head out to Rosewood because we've got oh wow, look, boxes in there as well. Yeah, I've got all those uh, like uh, the freezers full of uh, all the food and stuff that we left. So we really need to go and get that. Actually, uh, that might be next episode because uh, the electric is going to go off. So we could really do is setting somewhere up, um, getting a generator and setting somewhere up so we could get all that food, move it over here, get it all uh, set up. Have I got a? water bottle on me. I thought I had one. Do I not? Oh, I've got some can of... got a can of beans, though. That probably won't do much in the way of thirst, but... Oh, it's empty. Fair enough. Okay, well, let's eat the can of beans. Let's open can of beans. There we go. Oh, let's open it. Uh, yeah, it just does my hunger. Well, let's eat it all. There we go. That'll take care of one bar, anyway. Damn, there's just, there, yeah, there's just so much stuff here. It's crazy. Um, my guy needs to smoke as well. So let's smoke. And then we'll try and get in the control tower. Why not? Might as well. Uh, let's just wait a second. There we go. All right. Here, banging somewhere. Is that coming from here? Yeah, I can hear banging. I'm not sure where that is coming from, though. I think it might be that door. Yeah. Just open these doors up so we can... Oh, no. There we go. We can get in and out. Again, probably not a good idea blasting in the gun, but I'm going to do it. Oh, wow, there's an upstairs to this. Oh, a kitchen. Is that a kitchen? 
please have a sink. There we go. Brilliant. Let's fill up our bottle. There we go. Sort our thirst problem out. Uh, matches, sewing kits, yarn, value radios. All good stuff. I say I'm just... Ooh, hello. Right, let's stick that in the freezer as well. Keep the salmon and stuff nice and fresh. There we go. We found a kitchen. I mean, we could live in the control tower, couldn't we? That could be kind of cool. We could live in the control tower. And, oh, they've got freezers here. Nice. Um, mm. Processed cheese. Oh, a load of stuff in there. Nice. Let's grab all of that. Maybe not the pop, but we'll grab the rest of it. And uh, we'll stick it all. Fries as well. Stick a load of it in the freezer. Okay, bread. Bacon. Fries. Processed cheese. Steak. Cheese. Yeah, there we go. Nice. Oh damn, there's a lot of there's a lot of food here as well. Uh ooh, uh, bell pepper. Let's grab those. If they're in the crate, they're gonna uh fries are gone rotten, fair enough. Uh bell pepper, fries are gone rotten, bell peppers are going rotten as well, but we could uh, I think we're okay to cook with those. Although I have got a weak stomach, so maybe not. Okay, let's get some of that stuff chucked in there. Chuck those in there. Chuck the processed cheese in there as well. Cabbage. Yeah, you've got all the stuff on the side there. Uh, carton of eggs and those are all good. The tomatoes are getting a little iffy, but I think we're okay. If we cook with those, we should be okay with them. Um, they should turn not so... Not so mouldy. Where are we, tomatoes? I kind of feel like I'm getting surrounded here, but... Yeah, we could live... We could live in the control tower. That's a that's an option. Let's uh, go up the top here. Okay, I can hear a TV. It's not good. I should really be sneaking around. Oh, okay, here it is. Nice. Uh, let's switch this sucker off. Oh, let's turn the volume down first. Uh, we'll tune it into the Life and Living TV. Ah, there we go. Uh, what is on? Take a bear is the fiendiest, smallest, bounciest bear. Uh, if we watch the TV, we can level up, so. But. Ah, okay. Just leave it on. We'll leave it, like, really low for now. Ooh. Barracks. Yeah, we, we could live in the control tower. Um, that's that's a good spot. Yeah, military stuff. Let's have a quick search. I mean, we could even get out onto the roof. Do some stuff on that. Hmm. Yeah, there's like loads of uh, clothing. That would be good. Yeah, I'm going to have to bring get uh, some of the vehicles together. And if we can find some tow ropes or something, that would be great. Uh, I'm going to just turn this thing off for now, I think. Although the volume's really low, let's just switch it off. Uh, but if we watch the life and living, we can level up. I haven't actually done that yet. Uh, totally forgot about it. But, uh, yeah, we can level up. Uh, bin, garbage bag's going to be good again. I say, I'm just being picky. So, I know, I know I'm probably going to miss, like, a ton of loot. Toilet zombie. Please don't be a toilet zombie. There we go. Please don't be a toilet zombie. Because, yeah, toilet zombies were a nightmare last time. <laughs> I'm going to shut them because, you know, they're shut then. I can hear, still hear banging. But I don't know where that's coming from. Ooh, is that like a gun case? Duct tape and a saw. Ah, in here? Ah, where the hell is that? Ah, upstairs, maybe? Okay, let's go upstairs. This is bad. I don't like this. I don't like this. I hate going upstairs, man. It's a nightmare. Aha! Yeah. You're stuck in there. Can we... 
No, we can't open the door. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, it's like, oh, it's the control, actual control tower bit. Well, hopefully you break, I mean, we could take it apart, but hopefully over time you'll just break that down. It's a really tough door, though, so might take a little bit of time on that one. But There you go. That's cool. Uh, let's go out the back. I'll say, I'm kind of leaning towards here. We could live here. We could live here. Uh, it's a place to sleep as well. Uh, we've already been in there. Yeah, so we've been up there. I've been there. Uh, there's burnt out buildings on that way. And then there's buildings over this side. It's getting really late though, isn't it? So I don't want to do too much more exploring. Um, yeah, we just could do with boarding this, barricading this front entrance. Maybe just move one of these trucks in the way. Block it off. Something like that. Oh, hello. Hello. Take you down. Yeah, there's a few stragglers left, but there's not many. Short crossbow bolt. Okay, uh, but we don't actually check these cars, did we? Do they have any keys or anything? That's a good point. Got a Land Rover and a Spiffo's van, I think. Okay. Regular tyre, type heavy duty. No, okay. Ooh, got in the Spiffo's van, and we got a Spiffo's key. Nice. Do we have any fuel? No, we don't. It's okay, though. What does it... Uh, what does it look like? Condition-wise? Uh, it looks pretty good, actually. Uh, vans are really loud, but... Should have good capacity, which would be ideal for... Oh, okay. Alright, well, I can't, I can't look in the back, but... There should be a decent load capacity in there, so... Uh, that could be a that could be a really good van to just drive around and you know collect up all of this stuff. Yeah, the the bodies are an issue. I kind of figured we'd get a I mean, maybe we won't get a helicopter because we're in here and we're safe. Mm. I'm not too sure to be honest. Either that or we could live down here. At some of these. Oh, what are these buildings over here? Yeah, it's buildings over here that I don't know what they are. So um, I feel like here is a good spot because the fuel is just up there. Oh, where did you come from? Uh, the fuel is just up there, so we kind of want to be close to that, really. Uh, we don't want to be going too far to get to it. Uh, nothing in there. I don't think there's much. Ooh, there's that generator. We really want that generator, but how the hell do I get to it? Ooh. Ooh. Okay. I was trying to try the door, but never mind. <laughs> ah, I don't think there's much in there. Can I take the fence apart? Carpentry. No. Hmm, can I just pick the generator up? Info, connect generator, take generator. Yeah, there is a generator there, but I can't seem to get to it. Uh, we could probably get the sledgehammer. We won't be able to smash that down. There was a sledgehammer uh, in one of these. Yeah, these are like sort of tents. Uh, yeah, we did come over here, but we didn't actually go in there. Can I blast any of these zombies? That's just my only concern, is I'd really like to be able to blast some of these zombies. Ooh. Yeah, there seems to be like a point where I can actually shoot them. But it's it's a finite point. When they're up against that fence, I can't hit them. But there does seem to be a point where I can hit them. Uh, but when they go up against the fence, I can't seem to hit them. They become one with it or something. Uh, but it would be nice to... Yeah, because I mean, I'd say that's why I, that's why I fired the gun off in here. Because you'd think all of these extra zombies would have come in on you. Uh, plus, we also got a ton of ammo. So, uh, you know, that was, a, that was also a factor in my decision to fire the gun. Otherwise, I would have cleared this. If this was just Rosewood or, you know, Riverside or somewhere... I would have just cleared it out with an axe. Or just cleared a section of it out. Um, kind of curious. We might spend the night in this building, I guess. I wonder what this building is. Can we get in this building? That's a good question. No. It's probably the answer. Oh, no. Yes, we can. Oh, hello. 
Hello, people. Out you come. We are just shotgun crazy right now. Ooh, can we shoot you? Yes, we can. Oh man, this thing's just a beast. <laughs> yeah, this this fort is so good. You gotta you gotta install it. <laughs> Put the mod on, man. It's so good. Ooh, can we get that guy? Oh damn. Ooh. Um. I think. Banging from somewhere. Don't like this. Upstairs, maybe? Oh, hello. Scared the crap out of me. We could spend the night here. We don't have any... Don't have any water, do we? I was going to say we could spend the night, but we don't have any water, and there's not really anywhere to sleep here. Oh, okay. I can't go around. Fair enough. Nice. I'm just kind of exploring this place at the moment. I had a lot of fun just exploring. Yeah. Wow. This place is just phenomenal. It's got everything. Literally everything. Uh, you know, uh, it's just so many boxes, crates. Uh, there's a radio up there. I should have probably turned that off. There's just, I mean, look, there's just, can we? Oh, yeah, we can open that as well. Ooh. Oh, boy. More guns. <laughs> we got any long crossbow bolts? Oh, yes. I want long crossbow bolts. Damn. There is just so much stuff. I can't believe it. It is just... Oh, my God. Yeah, I think we're probably just going to go to Rosewood and just blast everybody. <laughs> um... I think that's probably an available option. Just the amount of weapons we've got is just... It's just uh, oh my god, I just can't believe it. And then, oh my god. Damn. So like my last playthrough, I think I managed to finally get a gun. Uh, like a double barrel shotgun. I think that's about all I'm... Oh my god, this place is... This is like obviously a weapon rack. Ooh, what's that? Got a scope on it. <sighs> yeah, I managed to get like one double barrel shotgun, I think, in my last play. Let's play. This time round. Yeah. Yeah, this is obviously the armory or something. Wow. Cricket uncooked, okay. Wood axe as well. Oh my god. So there's tons of suppressors. <sighs> Yeah, it's going to take me so long to go through all this stuff. I think a 5.56 uh, magazine. There we go. We'll take the bullets for that as well. It's 10 o'clock. We need to just kind of haul ass back to back to base, really. All right, let's just let's get moving. Oh, it's upstairs. Is this all? Oh, my God. Damn, this is all ammo. Gee, oh, my God. Yeah, this is all ammo. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Yeah, we probably just gonna kind of make play have a gun playthrough to be honest and just blast. I think we've got the ammo to do that. It's just insane. I can't believe I mean I guess I should have met really just Yeah, I I really need to go home, but Pins just got distracted by all the lovely shiny toys that are everywhere a silent oh my god there's just so much stuff I just I can't believe it the mother load I named I named, named the last episode wrong this is the mother load damn and then there's these hangers as well can we go in there and just have a quick look I should be going home I know that but oh wow Oh, we're not going to be able to get in there. Can we dismantle that in any way? Hmm. Might be able to sledgehammer that. Unlocked door. Ooh. 
No, I don't have the key. Um, but I'm assuming that's full of weapons as well. Can I sledgehammer that down? Oh my god. Yeah, if that's full of weapons, and then I mean, are this one going to be full of weapons as well? Oh, we need some keys. That's really what we need. We need some keys to this place. Uh, or I need to, there is a sledgehammer that might break that down, but I don't know whether it will. But, oh my god. Can we get in here? I don't suppose we can. No. Again, might be able to sledgehammer our way in, but then there's going to be a... So that could be full of ammo as well. Wow. Okay, yeah, I think we are uh, shooting. Can we just shoot some of these zombies as well? Yes, we can. Yeah, I was like, um, if I do this in Rosewood, I'm going to need to go prepared with a lot of ammo and magazines and, you know, everything already. But I'm kind of leaning towards just blasting everyone in Rosewood, to be honest. Um, we've got the ammo for it. We could just kind of have a bit more of a gun playthrough. And uh, we'll try the try the sciences out as well. But I think what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to walk home. Uh, I'll maybe run home. Uh, we'll have a smoke as well. Because uh, my guy's getting a little freaked out. So we'll have a smoke. Although actually I should have done that before at the end of the day. But never mind. Um, yeah, we found... I'm kind of leaning towards maybe the control tower living in. But there's just so many good places to be honest. Where we are is not bad. But it's a bit too small. So we've definitely got to move somewhere else. Uh, we could live in a hangar, I guess. I mean, yeah. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. What do you think? Where we should, where should we live? We've got the whole hospital, but I'm not sure they're going to be able to actually live in there or not. Oh, get the door open. Might have to take the doors apart or sledgehammer them off or something. But um, yeah, anyway, I think I'm just going to walk home anyway for now. And then, uh, you know, we'll pick it up in the next episode. Um, what are we going to do? I don't know. We're definitely staying here. I didn't get the helicopter, so I'll probably do another episode, and I'll try and explore. We'll try and go in the hospital, maybe. Um, I don't know. We might need to take a hammer and a screwdriver and take the doors off or something. I'm not sure if we can get in there, but we I haven't really tried. So uh, we'll try and go in there, and yeah, we've, we've got to sort these bodies out as well. It's really bad. So, uh, But uh, yeah, anyway, for now, this is where I'm going to call it and end the episode. So if you like that one, please give me a thumbs up. Comment with your thoughts down below. Subscribe for more. I really do appreciate it. Stay safe out there, everyone, and I'll catch you next time. And the lights just switched on as well. Sweet. <laughs>